I now do raffles on my Instagram daily, so if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one, shoot my Instagram a follow. It's jcresells559. Same exact name as my YouTube name. Thank you guys for the support, and I hope to see you in the future raffle. What is up, everybody? These two mystery boxes got here. This is from two different people. I have not done this video in quite some time, but these are both $1,000 boxes. I'm going to open both of them, compare them, and then you guys will let me know which one you guys think is more worth it. I made a post on Instagram asking for mystery boxes for this type of video, so shout out to these two people for sending me the box. There should be a no insight as to who it's from. But yeah, this is, like I said, they're both $1,000. I asked for everything to be brand new, so hopefully there's some good shoes in here. Let's go ahead and start off with the box on the left, though, and see what's in that one. All right, here we go. I just got the top box open. There's a little note right here saying who it's from, by the way. This is from Space City Collective, which is a sneaker store in Texas. I've done plenty of videos on them before. So yeah, that's who this first box is from. And here's how it's looking. Already see a good box. So yeah, let's get into this. Here's the first shoe, a Nike SB. This is a size eight, by the way. And here it is. Don't really recognize this colorway. I'm pretty sure it's an older one, but here it is. Here's the design and colorway all, all around. Passport right there in the tongue. Here's how the bottom looks, brand new as you can see. So here's the first shoe. Hopefully it's going for a good amount. Yeah, size eight for these. Mark is actually pretty weird on them. Um, last set was 160 though, so that's what I'll put in. That's pretty much lowest ask. So 160 for that, it's the first shoe. Let's go with this now. This is a Air Max Supreme, size nine and a half. Here they are. Oh, that's pretty cool colorway. Haven't seen these in person before. Got the pink on it as well, black and red. So this is pretty sick color combination right here. Yeah, I don't see these or this color combo too, too often. So yeah, this is a pretty sick shoe. Hopefully they're going for a good amount, but yeah, here, let's find out. Market's actually very high on them. Size nine and a half. I'm going to mark it at like 340. Yeah, I wasn't expecting them to go for that much. I guess other people like the color combination too, but yeah, that's 500 with the first two shoes now. Pretty good start. Here's a huge Jordan box right here. It's a Jordan 14 size 12 and a half. And they are, I forgot what they're called, but... Pretty sure this colorway is going for a good amount. Black and red right here. Not a big fan of 14s, but this is a pretty decent colorway. And this is the last shot, Jordan 14s. Very big difference between market. Last sell was 480. More recent sells, not looking that good to be honest. I mean, it's kind of all over the place. Jordan 14s is usually harder for me to sell though. Kind of a tougher size. I'm gonna mark it at like 400. I think that's fair. I think that's still kind of a hard price to get, but we'll see what I can do with them. But 900 with the first three. Two more shoes to go. Going kind of fast since I have to go through two different boxes. But here's a Jordan 13 in a size 12. Here they are. This is a definitely an older shoe right here. And they're brand new. So here's the second to last shoe overall from the Space City box. This is called a Dirty Bread Jordan 13s, size 12. They're going for about 280 right now. So 280, I'm already at 1180. 180 over from what I paid. I haven't paid for these boxes yet, but I'm pretty sure it's a thousand flat. I don't know if I have to add shipping or not. But here's the last shoe. This is a size nine and a half. So here they are. I got this type of shoe once before in the past from a Sneak City box. So this is, this is just my second time getting this style of shoe. Hopefully they're going for a good amount, but this is the last one here from the Space City box. And a size nine and a half. Again, a pretty big difference between market. I'm just gonna market at 180. I think that's fair. So 180, everything adds up to 1360, which is 360 in profit if I could get the prices I said, if I didn't have to add for shipping. So pretty good start here from the Space City box. Shoe wise, kind of tougher, but I mean, the profit is worth it if I could get the prices I said. So, yeah, that's the first box here from this challenge. So, let's get rid of this box right here. And let's get into that one to see who it's from and what's in it. All right, here we go. Got it cut open. Hopefully, there's a note in here because for this box, I don't know who it's from. 
Oh, well, you see it no right away, so that's good. Here's how this box is looking. You can see the at right there. And again, this is a $1,000 mystery box. So let's get into this. I already know what shoe this is based off the box. So we'll just start off with it. It's a size 10 and a half right here. These are the Jordan 3 Cardinal Reds. And they're brand new. So a good shoe right here. Pretty sure they're going for like around 230. And like I said, they're going for around 230. So that's what I'm gonna mark it at. 230 for that. That's the first shoe from the box. Good start. There's five total shoes in here. So let's go with this Jordan one. This one's a size 10, my size. And here they are. I forgot exactly what they're called. I think the rust something. But I know market on these was pretty low back then. They were under retail, but I mean, I haven't checked in a while, so hopefully it went up. And it's size 10 for those, going for exactly retail, about 170. So 170 for that. Exactly 400 with the first two. Let's go with this box right here. This is a size 10. And they are, ooh. Here they are, the Jordan 5s right here. I forgot exactly what they're called. But they are brand new, so this is my first time ever getting this shoe. And a pretty sick colorway. Can't go wrong with the black and yellow colorway right here. So let's see what they're going for. I actually have no idea, but hopefully it's a good amount. So I didn't even notice. These are the Michigan Jordan 5s. And they're going for... I'm going to mark it at last sale, which is 270 So 270 for that. I'm at 670 Two more shoes to go. Here's this white Jordan box. This is a woman's Jordan 11. The only woman's Jordan 11 low I know is the violet something. The white and violet colorway. Oh, and these. Uh, this another shirt. I forgot exactly what they're called. It's like a starfish colorway though. I actually really like this. Here's the shoe. Sick colorway. Wait, what size was it again? 12 in women's. If it was 11 half in women's, I probably would have debated on keeping these. Because seeing them in person for the second time now, <laughs> I'm starting to like them more and more. But here's the fourth shoe overall. And this is the Citrus Jordan 11 Low. Pretty big difference between ask and bid. Last sale was 270, which is kind of in between. So that's what I'll mark it at, 270. So I'm at 940, $60 away from what I paid. Here's the last shoe. It's a Jordan 1 box. It's a size 8.5, so not that small. Get rid of this real quick. All right, so here we go. Size eight and a half. These are, oh, the University Blue. Jordan one's right here. Brand new, lace is still attached. So a really good ending right here. Pretty sure these are going for like around 360 to 400. Market on these is actually just a little lower than I thought. They're going for about 350 right now. So with the 350, everything adds up to 1290. Let's just add 10. Basically 1300 for this box from, here's the Instagram again. The two-hand bowler. So yeah, guys, here's the two mystery bucks I got. Go ahead and compare them. See which one you guys think is more worth it. This one from the sneaker store Space City Collective. And this one from the Instagram reseller, whose Instagram is the two-hand bowler. So yeah, let me know down in the comment section below what you guys would prefer, which box you guys think was more worth it. I think they're both pretty good. Everything was brand new like I asked for. Profit but for both boxes exceeded the 20% ROI that I usually look for. So shout out to both sellers for making me this box. But yeah, that's pretty much gonna wrap up the video. This was pretty fun doing. I'm probably gonna do this again soon. Getting two different boxes from two different people and comparing it. But yeah, also let me know out of all 10 of these shoes, which shoe is your favorite? I'm gonna pick one from each. From this one, I would go with the Supremes. Those, the colors on those, they just, they just really stand out to me. So I like those. For these, I mean, these three are all super nice to me, but I'd probably go with the 11 lows. I just like the bright colors on them, but yeah, those are my favorite. Let me see your guys' favorite in the comment section below. But that's pretty much going to wrap up today's video. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel. Drop a like on the video. Don't forget to leave a comment, and I'll see you guys next time. I now do raffles on my Instagram daily, so if you're into that kind of stuff and want to join a future one, shoot my Instagram a follow. It's jcresells559. Same exact name as my YouTube name. Thank you guys for the support, and I hope to see you in the future raffle.